Well, it's a shave before two. I just got home from dropping off the knives from yesterday. I went by the thrift store and picked up two nice little knives. As you can see, the Rancho Max Back 40 needs cutting. It's growing up like wildfire. So that's the start of the day's honeydew. With the wind still kicking up, I gotta cut the front too. You can see the front is looks like the back. I gotta change the oil in my uh, cutter. It was due to do it last month, but I never got around to it. And then, as I do once a year, I'm gonna clean out the ranch mobile, the Max mobile, the mobile detector. There's all kinds of stuff back here. No telling what we'll find. Here's the uh, brass and copper stuff I found most of the summer, spring and fall. There's some more of it in there. There's a lot of crap in here. Should probably get 10 miles better gas miles after I clean her out. I had them knives right here. What do I do with them knives? One's a nice heckle. Well, that's amazing where they could have gone to. Stand by. Well, I got the oil draining and there's some cat litter. Give her a couple minutes. I found the knives. Like I said, one's a nice heckle. German heckle. And the other one says it's a R O S T F R E I maybe. Solinger, Germany. 63 cents I paid for both of them. Pretty good deal. Okay, stand by. There's all the little brass. There's all the big brass and copper. There's the odds and ends that was back there, the small stuff. That's all the keys. I already had some sinkers, so that's 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 what was in there, sinkers. Now I gotta go through all this tomorrow after it dries good. This is what I washed out of the bed. A rice burner. Ten miles to a gallon plus. I got her in the neighbor's driveway downhill. I mean uphill. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That's pretty damn good right there for old Junior. So it's Friday. We're at the cave. Inbound. I see the cave is kind of crowded with hunters today. I see a deep hunter. I see Doc Beaver. And I see somebody else. Stand by. We'll see what it looks like. There's Doc Beaver and somebody. There's the deep man. I walk along this little slough till I get up there where they are. Where the cave is. Hey. Well, that's the guru. I didn't recognize the guru from a distance. Bobby's wife in the pink. The guru. He's dressed for wintertime. The cave. The illustrious cave. What are you doing up here? You cold? Damn right. Huh? It's supposed to be 81 today. Where's the sign at? Well, you look like it. You ought to think it's 31. You look like a what? <laughs> you look like it's 31. Show me some tickets. What is that? Pocket knife? Nah, I don't uh, know what that is. 
got a silver dollar. Silver dollar? Cool. Yeah, that's what I say. About time. I always bet you. Not so far that in yet. How long you been here? Is this a crack of dawn? No, I've only been here about an hour. Yeah. I'm in a big hurry to get out of here. Not so much a glass. Tide ain't low till 1.12.30 or so. Oh, yeah. Here, I mean. Denny down there? Yeah. You see Bobby? How's he doing? I ain't talked to him. He's out there in the damn water. That's a half a dollar. That ain't a silver dollar. Yeah, half a dollar. Stand in Liberty. Nice taquita. Okay. Holy jumping Toledo. If that baby's real, I'm a quit detective forever. You got more diamonds than the Hope Diamond. Cutting little pieces. Stand by. Let's get that taquita out right of there. Yes, sir, boy. Yes, sir, That's a ticket. <laughs> oh, diamond. Cut up in little pieces. It's the right color, but that's all it is, is color. Some kind of pot metal, I guess. You can see it kind of wearing away right along now. I was excited for a few minutes. That's like a three-pill nitro right there, boys. Three-pillar. Ah, you can tell you're having a good day when you find a marble. A nice fat marble. Stand by. I don't know if you'd be able to see it too good, but right there at the edge of the cave on the easter side is a cut like. All the sand's been cut. That east wind cut a little cut right there, you see it? Well, what it did, if you look, it moved it all the sand right there. It's like a sandbar right there alongside of that wall, which has never been there before. In a few minutes, I hope that'll dry right up right there. I've never seen anything like that before. That's pretty cool. It's freezing up. Getting rough here. And all it work. Look at it. Ah! What's it I found? I wanted to crack it open and see what it was. That's what was in there. See something cool? See it hanging right down my spoon? Looks like a charm bracelet or something. Stand by. It's got crosses on it, little rings on it. All kinds of stuff. Pretty cool. I got a bunch of rings. That baby's got three rings on it. <laughs> Damn, look at that. That one's got a fat diamond in it. That one's got a three, three or four fat diamonds in it. Cool. Getting rougher. Ah. Bobby's got, got two new faces in the lane today. Might be some guys in town for the hunt. There's a big hunt going on this weekend at the club. Planning to hunt on the beach at 58th Street. Maybe some visitors. Hey, Sonali! Sonali! up all the time. Ah. Some dry 
on the spigots. Look at that. That's the best fossil. Looks like a fern. Uh, yeah, it does, doesn't it? Like, yeah. like a fern. 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 A dime, a couple of pennies. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that one is that's just kind of neat. Well, look at the water running out of that thing. Running in the back of it. It's almost fun when you head it up in the air. Yeah, definitely either a fern that's or on top of like a Vic li pick lighter there. Yeah. You think that old whiskey bottle maybe? No. Hard to tell. Well, I just dropped Danny off, and as we were headed home, I got a call from one of my knife customers, yard customers. She wanted me to pick up some stuff and drop it off to her on Sunday when I go to the knife gig. I went by and see what she had, and I'll show you in a few minutes. One of them might be a stumper. This is a push lawnmower by Scott's. It's a little teeny small job. I don't know if you got to sharpen these blades or sharpen the bar on the bottom that it goes across. You see where it hits right there? I don't know. I got to get a hold of Scott's and find out. And then she's got this little hole looking job. Wants to sharpen that up. And she's got a little baby hoe. <laughs> little aluminum garden shovel. I don't know why she wants everything so sharp. That one's ready. Wasn't too much to do to this one. A little touch up. Run a tip. Same thing with this one. Just trim the ears up a little bit. D-O-N-E. On to the mower. Well, here we are at the roundup. We got a what's it. I don't think it's anything but some iron, but I don't know if you can see this piece of plastic running through the middle of it. That's the reason I saved it, because I thought it was something, but under close observation, I think it's just junk up. We got another one here. We got, I don't know what this is. I thought it was a compass, but it may be some kind of gauge or something. It looks like a compass to me. I don't know what it would have went in with this thing hooked on it. And I hit this thing and I have no clue what that is. I thought this was a pure junk ring when I dug it up. But you'll be able to see it. It's, uh, I guess, silver, plated, plated silver. It says 925 right there. Size 8. And then I got that little bracelet. That's a 925 too. It's hard to see, but it's stamped right on the side of that little obstacle all right there, 925. It's got a... One, two rings on it. I thought it had three rings on it. A crucifix or a cross and a lock and a key and a, I don't know what that doodad is. A star, a, another lock. One ring, two rings. I thought it had a big ring on it somewhere. I mean, not a big ring, but a, a bigger one than that. Anyway. That was okay. I had I got two batteries, but I don't know where the other one is. But I know I dug up two. One nickel, one dime. No bathing suit hook and naggy thing. And the best of it. Marble. It's really breezed up. You can't see it's thundering. Got worse than what it was. It's light. No, it's not lightning, but it's raining. You might be able to see that on the wind, wind, wind stills. It's dark as pitch. Look at the trees blowing. And I'm only looking from the back side of the house. It's cooking pretty good. I don't know what tomorrow's going to be like. I haven't checked the forecast. We'll have to see how it goes. Okay. 
See you tomorrow, weather permitting. Oh, uh, well, you saw the uh, guru's uh, stand of liberty, and I'm trying to think what Danny found. Danny found a really big, nice conch shell. Some other stuff. I got Giant's nut in the in the video. Stand by.